It's a good deal. <laughs> can never go wrong. <laughs> It's and just <laughs> yeah, dude. German dudes get real pissed when you talk about that shit, man. No, not, and it's, no, and it's to, dude, nah, it's dude, to, dude, not really. Dude, well, that, I thought you're. If you say it, you're, okay, you can go to jail. I think they're used to. Well, it. No, but you so can go to jail, right? And we'll see if you go in like, Berlin. Maybe they'll get pissed, but Munich, they, they don't give a fuck. See, like, like, we're we're the fucking like Germans. No, Nazi well, party started. Well, Bayern is like the fucking. <laughs> the, 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 <laughs> we're like the, the rednecks of Germany, so it's like we don't give a fuck. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But like. You like to poke fun. <laughs> but see, here's the, the thing. Like, is that like, say for example, if you go into like the center of Berlin and screamed out, I don't believe in the Holocaust, you could be jailed because yeah. denying the Holocaust is illegal. It's a, yeah. it's a sin. Yeah. And then when they play, it's, when, it's they play sin. when they play <laughs> Call of Duty 2, yeah, German that whole German part is just cut out. It's yeah. just like, J- Japan, that's it. That's all, <laughs> that's all that happened. Don't worry about the rest. The soldiers run at you and then that's yeah, that's it. It. It's like that Family Guy episode where it's just like they went went to Germany and Brian's just like hey Germany, there's yeah. no information based on what happened between 1939 and 1945 <laughs> and the German guy's like there was nothing that happened we were all happy we all drank beer and schnitzel <laughs> 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 it was a good time <laughs> yeah what, what did they even talk like what did they teach in history class in Germany <clears throat> like do they do they go they probably go over that shit right like World War One probably point of view, right? Like, like, I mean, V1. <laughs> That's nothing, all you know. There was one dude. <laughs> I think they kind of like studiously avoid it because we learned like, Because I did, I did, I, I did go to school there for a little bit, and we just learned fucking Greek, fucking. Oh really? Ancient Greek, fucking. Yeah. That's like for for us, we're, we're just like we love to pride ourselves on Canadian World War One. Oh, it's like apparently we're so Canadians were badass in World War One. We pissed it. Yeah, just <laughs> it. We peed in our own fucking cups with chlorine gas and shit. Remember, like, and then Vimy Ridge, dude. You remember Vimy Ridge? That's all I. Well, that's all I knew. Because, because the best way to pretty much sum it up is like, because Britain and like France were like suffering for like months to take Vimy Ridge, and we're like, we could probably do it in a week. And then Britain's like, all right, sit down there, Canada. I bet you can't. Hey, we took the ridge. Yeah, Wait, we what? <laughs> we just got a bunch of dude in red flannels that came up there with fucking like. They're polar bears. Yeah. <laughs> really, and really I remember, got it going. Literally just I remember, rolled yeah. up, just like, let's go, boys. <laughs> <laughs> I remember there was an actual story um, where a Canadian military, or a Canadian uh, division, I guess, uh, there were German tanks coming towards them, and they didn't have tanks. So what they did is they hopped on bikes, and they pedaled towards <laughs> the German tanks, and the Germans, of course, were so distracted, no, they, were just like, they yeah, fucking were the able to destroy the tanks. Canadians are Canadians right, right behind them, <laughs> just destroyed the tanks, and then just <laughs> won the battle. You gotta watch it. You got, you got roof yeah, Koreans, fucking... you got bike Canadians. You gotta be real careful about those fucking uh, bike Canadians. But see, now just imagine... Hockey stick on the back, they're just like, hey, bad Pulls out the hey, rifle. can you get the fuck out of my way, bud? <laughs> like, trick of the Tim's. What's hey, it? <laughs> what? it? Oh, it's a bit chilly out here, bud. You want a Tim bit, bud? <laughs> get, see, get a behind now, the German tank, so just having a smoke. It's like, <laughs> What is that? <laughs> like they just see the Canadians. Like imagine like a little tricycle <laughs> going towards them. Germans are like, "What is that? Is, is that it's not the Canadians?" Far off the Russians though, no. just unicycle bears juggling. Like you know what I mean? Like the, 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 the super like, yeah, the, 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 yeah, yeah. No, oh, fuck. It's very impressive. You know, you know that? Like, how does war work? Because like, <laughs> here's a bro- what's it good for, man? <laughs> well, like, what is it good for? <laughs> But you know, you know that story where it's like, yeah, man. In, in during Christmas, the the two lines on the like, frontier, like the Germans and the Americans, got along for a day and they played soccer and shit. <laughs> like on the, and then they went back to their bunkers. Mm. Like what the fuck? You're killing someone you just like made acquaintance with. That's not like how does well, they Jesus don't was the man back then? Did, did they not? Want Jesus to was <laughs> the man. So what happened? Like, they just they just celebrated Christmas for a year. They're like, dude. You saw, did Hitler. you see the movie? Fuck you! There's, there's a movie? Yeah, Merry yeah. Christmas. The historical yeah. movie. You have, yeah, dude, you didn't watch that? I'm gonna go fucking watch that then? movie. Nah, yeah. we, we watched, um... What did we watch? We didn't watch Saving Private Ryan. I feel like that would be too fucked up, but... We watched... Oh, I can't remember. Can't remember. Can't remember. Can't but remember. It was like a his, his, it was like a History <coughs> Channel documentary about Vivian Ridge or some shit. Mm-hmm. But, like, how does that work, man? Like, aliens. Aliens. Yeah, aliens. Yeah, ancient Yo, aliens. Confirmed. Illuminati My confirmed. dad loves ancient aliens. And I don't blame him. Your dad? It's an okay show. He fucking buys that shit. He he pretend he pawns it off like he doesn't like doesn't buy it. Mm. And then I'll be like I'll see him like taking notes and shit. Like <laughs> he's like on his iPhone and he's like North, left, right, center, Germ German. <laughs> he's like aliens came from the, the ground up. I'm like Dad, you, you don't want. He's like, yeah, yeah, I, I just like to poke fun at it. So. <laughs> <laughs> he's like, no, 
uh, none of it's real, obviously. <laughs> See, the thing I love about Asian aliens is the guy could be like, where did calculators come from? <laughs> aliens. <laughs> aliens. Aliens. Like, the, one guy, like, the, the big ass fucking air. Fucking aliens. aliens. How were computers made? Aliens. But it's a, it's a good speculation. <laughs> like, like, sometimes, how would you know? You know? Yeah. I feel like aliens exist. I love when they get uh, super historic and religious on it. Yeah. yeah, the one like Christian guy. It's not aliens, man. It's the Lord. <laughs> God, of course, Jesus. There was the a crop circles in uh, in South America. Have you guys mm-hmm. seen those? Mm-hmm. The fat. Yeah. You can see them from space. It's like a monkey, but they're they're just oh, the, um, in the um, oh, oh, what's really? it called? The, um, the crop circles. They're not crop no, circles. no, they're, they're called like, the um. Jamie, pull up the crop. They're like c- considered a wonder. The, the something lines. The, the something lines. Um, <laughs> yeah. yeah. Fuck. Like people think those are made by aliens. Yeah. Top, top right. Ja- oh, there it is, Jamie. Yeah, there you found it. Well, oh, they don't okay. think that they were necessarily made okay, by yeah, aliens. Okay, yeah, yeah. But they're like, yeah, that's yeah. they're like, there's like a <laughs> drawing of the monkey. Can you zoom in? You know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, and, and then the bird, and, and you can only see them from space. So people yeah. <laughs> think <laughs> about the ancient society that built them. <laughs> they're like, okay, why the fuck did they make these monuments to the to the gods to the sky? You know what I mean? Aliens. Or it could have been just like this artistic fucking Leo da Vinci guy who made like a wingsuit. He could probably. Fly up there, see his creation. It's probably probably just some guy just like, oh, I, I could probably do that. And yeah. Some guys like, no. He's like, oh, well, well, okay. I'll, I mean, we do that on a smaller yeah, scale yeah, nowadays. Have you seen Ink Master, the tattoo? Well, I mean, show? you, you got to yeah. do it on a big yeah. scale. That's some crazy day, shit. They, they did, you see the one with the stairs, where they have to get the staircase, and then if you look at it from a certain perspective, it's like a whole mural. So what? like the staircase goes up like this, and like then each tattoo? each stair is like a is like a piece of flash, right? Each stair is a piece of art, and it all combines into one thing when you look at it, like, on an angle. Fuck. It's like one of those fan arts, you know, like, when yeah, you, like Asian fans, and they have, like, the... Well, like, conceptual art. Yeah, yeah, exactly, yeah. But, like, I mean, I feel like that's not that far fetched. <coughs> basically. I don't know, I've never made crop circles down. <laughs> Fuck you guys. <laughs> they still appear everywhere. Yeah, yeah, but I feel like that's just, yeah. like... Chicken for, for real though, you guys, you guys, you guys, you guys think there's aliens? Yeah, for sure. Yeah. Oh, oh absolutely. Dude, Hundy, Hundy P, Hundy P, Hundy I don't think, like, I don't think, I, I, I think it'd be no, there's impossible <laughs> if there <laughs> weren't any. I don't think they look like what they, what everyone thinks. With all the, like the, the gray, no, that's impossible. With all the millions and billions of other galaxies out there, it'd be like egomaniacal to think of only. Yeah. The only problem is the only the argument is that it's not that one theory. It's like if aliens existed, they would have already existed. Like they would have already came to Earth. But there's, there's mm-hmm. but it's so a paradox much, because so it's so yeah because it's so it's so it's so vast yeah. like yeah. it's like it's like saying it's like yo if, if time travel exists my future self is gonna come back to this moment and punch me in the dick yeah right but it could happen we don't know but he's like, not here so. yeah <laughs> like exactly. there's way dope shit to do in the future so why yeah it, it's exactly. like yeah, exactly it's like when uh, it's probably gonna get his haircut exist, <laughs> yeah okay. it, it's like <laughs> okay. it's totally like it's like when haircuts. Stephen Hawking threw uh, a welcoming party for people. Who could time travel from the future to the past? Okay. And of course, no one showed up because it was meant for people who could time travel to the past. Which yeah. Of course, no one could because that's what Stephen Hawking wants you to think. Though. Stephen Hawking is dead. May he rest his soul. <laughs> I'm that sorry. I'll, I'll bleep that out. That is a fact. <laughs> that is a fact. No, that is a, that is a true fact. He, he I think. Think, I think our audience. I thought Hopefully he was, they knew already. I thought he was going right? to live forever, though, <laughs> to be honest. Unless our audience is just uh, Okay, what you said about the future thing, though? <coughs> I said, is there a future? You know, Does you it, know. Is the future, there, is there is a future. A, is, is it just a concept, though? That's the thing. A lot of people think that the, the present and the future and the past are all relative terms, meaning that you only experience the present right now, but you also experience the present when it was the past. And mm-hmm. you've also experienced the present when it's the future. Well, it's, it's how you're brought up, right? The, the clock is the symbol of our society. Mm. And if you think about it, when has it ever not been right now in your life? When will it ever be? Never. Not it's always right Nazca been. lines. That's what they're called, the Nazca lines. What the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> okay, right, you, know, right, you, know right, you know how literally, you know how literally <laughs> earlier, you know how literally earlier, uh, Nazca lines. and I, we were talking what about the, 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 the 
the drawings in the ground of the the big bird and the the monkey and everything and you can see yeah from when space. Jamie pulled that up yeah. yeah the Nazca lines that's what they're called I was trying uh, to figure Jamie, out what they were called you the Nazca get the lines Wikipedia page we had to fuck get man I was literally on, I was literally on my phone the whole time trying to figure out what the get fuck it was I'm like yeah. drawing of animals on the ground no <laughs> fucking bird on the ground uh, fuck fuck off. fucking monkey on the ground and like I couldn't find it and I so wait they made animals <laughs> like here like I'll, I'll pull show me show me yeah yeah Jamie would didn't do good enough so but Jesus no yeah so literally like. This ancient tribe in Peru drew, uh, made these lines in the ground, and essentially, like they did, like a monkey. Oh yeah, I've seen that. Yeah, that's sick. sick. That's actually crazy. It's sick as fuck. And that's from that's from like the Hubble, right? The telescope. Yeah. Or not the Hubble, sorry. Right, right not the, the Hubble. The, the space center. Just from space. Station. Uh, International yeah, yeah. Space Station. Yeah, ISIS. Yeah. But dude, yeah. Hubble telescopes. Hubble telescopes on Earth. They can, they can like. <laughs> but no, they put a mirror up there, like. Yeah. All right. Ah, there it is. There it is. Like it just. No, dude. <laughs> sick as fuck though. Like it's crazy. Like, we're work. Could, but um, but it's no. And, idea. Yeah. But no. Anyways, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I fucking believe in aliens, but yeah. I mean. I don't think they're. I used to have a smart. phobia of aliens. I was really? like tripping out. I have a phobia of like lights, you, and I've dude, been always of scared course. to admit it. Um, aliens are scary as fuck. Presences. If you aren't scared of fucking aliens at some point in your well, life, bro, yeah. then like. I don't think I'm ever gonna see them in my the lifetime. So. No, probably not. So, but I, see, I'm I have scared. a theory about aliens. Like, especially if they've already. I don't think they. Yeah, I think they've visited. Not. Visit, but everyone visited. Sorry, I can't but the Earth's been so. But it's been. It's been here for so long. You don't know if we're the first intelligent life forms. Yeah, we don't know. You know what I mean? And. But we, here's the thing: is that like I think just the first I think who came Earth. up? I can't remember who came up with the theory, but essentially the theory with the time. whole idea with aliens visiting us is that <laughs> is to essentially imagine the aliens looking at us like ants, like how That's we look I at ants, right? Scary. Like when you see an ant on the ground, you either a you walk away from it, you leave it, or you fucking squash the thing. You don't, you know, you don't wonder what it does one's or fucked anything. Up kid, he, like plays around with it, and yeah. lights on fire with the gun. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So, Burn okay, bitch, so, so fucking just... alien see us is like no, not even something that's worth their time. That's like at all. Dormammu. Just, like, they, they, from, it doesn't even exist in that. From Doctor thing. Strange, where he's like, that's Dormammu, where he's like this huge thing, and he just sees like us as ants. Right? Yeah, we're insignificant. That's like the. What, what did you say? Say it again. Dormammu. Dormammu. <laughs> Did you mean for me to say it again? <laughs> Fuck you. Fuck off. Fuck you. Well, it's part of our like subconscious to not. It, it has to do with like the human subconscious <laughs> to fear the unknown. That's pretty good. Yeah, and that so one, the that unknown would be something omnipresent, something. <laughs> Dude, what the that fuck that is a dorm mom? So <laughs> exactly. aliens, exactly. what is that? It's an that's excuse. How aliens, exactly. Yeah. It's no, no, I didn't see the movie. So, I used to, when I was I'm afraid totally of them, I'd yeah, look you, up you at this guy as a teenager. No, no, no. And I, would, I played like Ultimate I'd look Marvel at this guy long Capcom, enough, where he was like a fighter. To think Jamie maybe Fulton. there was a ship Oh, okay, okay. That was blending in with the night sky. And that was just a mirror of the stars beyond it. And I'd be like, how do I not know that there's a fucking alien ship right there? But that I can't perceive it. Mm. Well, what it's like that whole thing with the uh, um, um, Black Knight. Did you ever hear that thing with the Black Knight? Like, there's no. this weird ship-looking thing that goes around the Earth's orbit. Oh, yeah, it's, a, it's like a bunch it. of conspiracists say it's like a super old fucking Alien satellite sent out that fucking P- oh, super, super important people control yeah. it, and they, they can see what's going on, but, but we don't know, and they, they've nah. just told us it's a meteorite. It's a pro- yeah. You know those, there's, there's been, but, like, but it's actually a satellite, and they, they're though. watching us. There's been, like, ships <laughs> and shit. And oh, oh, yeah. Area 51 exists. Yeah, well, but here's what the I The government just confirmed it like a few years ago. I think so Area 51 yeah. exists Sorry, can I for a reason, not because <laughs> of aliens. <laughs> I'm going to buy this. Just to scare people. They had an alien gray, though, man. There was footage on YouTube. I saw it. Nah, dude. That's, that's going to get demonetized. That's Hear me out. What? Jamie's well, it's like the it's like the whole Arizona incident, like that incident that happened in Arizona, where like a whole like a whole town saw, essentially saw a yeah. whole bunch of alien spaceships. The um, the uh, the American Air Force fucking flew in with jets trying to shoot the thing down. Of course, they fucking blew off in two point two seconds. Like, like, like they just disappeared. <laughs> and then the government was trying, like the government was essentially trying to tell the whole town, whole town. Oh yeah, you guys didn't see anything. And it's like the whole town fucking saw what just happened. Really? I yeah. didn't hear about that. Yeah, the whole the was government was essentially what, Roswell. What is this? Uh, no, 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 this was like somewhere in Arizona, and like <clears throat> the fucking like five, six alien spaceships flew across the town. The whole town saw what the fuck was going on, and especially like there was a football game happening that night, so of course more people were seeing what was going on. And then, and so and, what would happen? And then the, the, the American government. Air Force came in 
to attack the ships, and the ships like fucked off, just blinked off in the blink of an eye. Do you think that's and then like, the government like tried to shut that shit down? Hallucination. Someone like. Spray, but with like, that many people ooh, seeing no, some, nah. like a whole no, town, yeah, everyone experiences though? drugs a different, different way. way even on even on like a super small scale, yeah. if it's yeah. the same fucking drug, even on a really nah, small yeah, scale, yeah, I suppose. So it wouldn't be the same hallucination. People would be like, "Oh, did did you see this? Did you see this? Did you yeah. see the alien shit? No, I saw saw the kangaroo." Oh. <laughs> hmm. But see, the one thing I I believe is like full out true. Uh, of course, I believe in aliens, but I also believe in the whole men in black thing. Like, you know how... No, not like okay. the ones from the movies. Yeah, like. There's black dudes out there, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I've seen three. Yeah. <laughs> I've seen a couple. Three. Yeah. Four seen four a couple. Yeah. It's chill, dude. <laughs> One out of three. Yeah. But no, like, the actual, like, men in black, though, apparently, like, they're bald, have no eyebrows, like, fucking expressionless, have, like, red lips, apparently, and, like, they're just, like... Must have a medical organization. <laughs> so they're, like, age, like, age of 47. Essentially. But, like, they, they essentially only the, come to you if, A, you're researching about aliens, or if, um, fucking, uh, B. you know too much about it, pretty much. Like... <sighs> And then they come in, they're like, but, stop but, talking but, about but, but it, and then the, they if, fuck off. If that were the yeah, case, wouldn't there's it, a lot of people that have, like, been, that say they had an experience with aliens that were were contacted they, were they or, right yeah, after like that, yeah. by men in black. Mm -hmm. But think about it, like, well, you know all those probing stories? Like, you know the Scooby-Doo What, where movie? you get a probe in the what? No, you know the yeah. Scooby-Doo movie in the desert? Plenty of people the aliens, were like, oh, I was abducted by aliens. Oh, oh yeah. 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 I vaguely remember that. There's, there's, like, a... The aliens like, that Shaggy and Scooby that. fall in love with. Mm. There's like an alien dog and an alien girl, and like okay. they're like pretending to be humans, and they're like, oh, like, like, shut the fuck up about the whole time. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah no, I remember. Yeah, now it's yeah, coming yeah. back to me. Yeah, yeah. No, I remember that. Where I was no. going with that. Yeah, no. <laughs> then you were going no, but that, that story, that classic story, is like, yeah, man, I was in my pickup truck, and I was probed up into the spaceship, and they they put a something in my <laughs> like that, that story is so That's common. I knew. I was a bad That, that was before just... the internet. And then a lot of people have that same story. <laughs> the, the fucked up thing, though, if that actually happened to some Steve or some Jim fucking redneck guy out there, <laughs> nobody would have fucking believed it. No, because he nuts. just got fucking raped by aliens. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> That's the fucked up thing. Man. <laughs> That's what I think. Where yeah, human what rights is against... he supposed to do? What's Jim supposed to he's do? Just Either get... fucking live his he's life. He's coming out like, you guys need trying to, to convince everybody that it's true. <laughs> Or accepting that it is. <laughs> like, that's and it. No, he, he's always choices. he's already fucking, fucking walking around like like this ass. all the time, legs spread because <laughs> he got his ass. He's broke. like, no, I swear, look at the size of my asshole. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even have a horse. <laughs> I don't own horses. <laughs> and then there's Not saying I would, but too. there's actually like dildos that like. Oh yeah, put no, eggs no. inside of women. One, of, one of the most Dragon fucking top, top selling dildos. Yeah. Dragon, Dragon, Dragon dildo. dildo. Yeah. 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 That's not, fucking uh, crazy, man. That's like a whole other. I'm gonna start investing in that's, that's an alien right there. <laughs> <laughs> People who buy that shit, that, those are aliens right there. Yeah. Yeah. That doesn't make sense to me, dude. Where, when did we become so uh, weird? That's all I'll say. Like, wait, what? We're fucking weird. When I was a boy. When I was a dude, there was just people wearing, like, Smash Mouth fucking <laughs> sunglasses, weird spiky hair. Now there's, like, really long fucking Jimbos out there mm. who, like, well, have hentai dolls. Like, I'm not judging. I'm yeah. just saying, when did, you <coughs> when did we become so weird, man? Okay, actually, the... Yeah, back in, like, fucking... Too much freedom. Three times those too were much real men. Too much those freedom. Are real. <laughs> those are real men. Those are real men. Not enough war every night. Not enough war and too much freedom. Yeah. <laughs> too much I mean, freedom. I know every, everyone's got their kink, you, go you know, and, every day, everyone, and you still don't wear everyone's got their That's thing. That's fucking real men. It's yeah, like how, um... It's like how, like, a few nights... Yeah. It's like how a few nights ago, though, in Vancouver, I saw the fucking craziest shit. I was walking down the street along, um... Granville. And all of a sudden I hear, all of a sudden I hear like this chick going, woo! And like I turn and this fucking guy, he's probably like 200 pounds, is holding up this chick. His, her legs is in between his arms and her like badge is like right in his face. Oh and they're God. walking down the street and he's just going at it. And is that Vancouver? What? Yeah, this is downtown Vancouver. And with your own with, eyes? With my own goddamn eyes. And like, what's even worse <laughs> is that she's just like taking his head, like, yeah, and, like, let's go. Once again, dude, when did like, we become so fuck? fucking weird? Like, I was literally standing there. I'm just like, you, you do you, man. Yeah. You, you go get that. <laughs> like, you're, stick your tongue in there. You're just old enough to see it. Yeah. You, Michael, her. you were just protected as a boy. I don't think so, man. I, see, I saw two girls on cup when I was pretty young. <laughs> I watched the whole thing. We all thing. did. Yeah. I watched, you watched I the whole thing? thing? You watched the whole Jesus thing? Jesus yeah. fucking Christ. I didn't know what it was at the time. It's yeah. another kind yeah. of... No, that's a, that's that a different kind of... Elephition glasses on me? Normal. <laughs> 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 it's 
<laughs> Yo, did you guys ever see One Man, One Jar? Yeah. yeah. I never uh, saw yeah. it, but I heard a lot about Pain it. Pain Olympics? Oh, okay. oh, oh Pain yeah. Olympics. Yeah. Fuck. Yeah. Yeah. I only so heard about that and I never wanted to watch I, it. I, I, don't, I watched don't, it at my, I watched it at my friend's birthday fucked. party. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> we like, the so eight of us. They got their thing. And they get their, they get like a hammer. He gets a fucking, no, he gets a fucking, a hatchet. Fucking chops off his fucking dick. Oh, yeah. like, I don't need to. They do that the, for the clout. He won. He won the BME Pain Olympics. Bro. Yeah. What do you win? Like a fucking BMX. A new <laughs> penis. <laughs> you win your penis back, dude. <laughs> yeah, they had like paramedics on stage. Yeah. But no, even watching like the shit like Happy Tree Friends that really kind of produced my fucked up mentality. Yeah. Fucking. Um, I saw that in like middle school. <clears throat> I saw one of them. I, I, did, I was so des- desensitized by them because in grade five I played World at War. Yeah. Which was like. You see half game. bodies everywhere and shit. Like the first, like I was playing Call of Duty Five, and then so we were playing multiplayer with like my my friends, hmm. and I was like ten years old, and then I watched some dude get his like leg blown off, and I like almost cried, <laughs> and then like a month later I was like, alright, that's normal. And then, I, and then now I watch like Mortal Kombat fatalities. I'm like, yeah, that's pussy shit. <laughs> <laughs> that's weak. You see like ISIS like beheading. I'm like, yeah. See, like, no, what's funny is that like, fucking um the one thing that really got me going when I was a kid back when I had my uh, my Nintendo sixty four. I was probably about eight, nine years old. My dad got me Conker's Bad Fur Day by accident. Just started oh, fucking playing Conker's dude. Bad Fur Day. That game God was damn. Fucking shit. That you can get drunk as hell in that game, right? There's that, that yeah. one mission. Shit. And then yeah, the donkey, donkey fucking, plays that. Uh, <laughs> the great mighty poo, you know. Fucking <laughs> opera singing he's, he's got this big off. I am uh, the great <laughs> mighty <laughs> poo. And I'm going to throw my shit. At oh, you. <laughs> yeah. What was that game? M for Mature? Yeah, Raid M for Mature. Is that my dad? You know what my dad said? He's like, you know, it's funny because, like, I just saw the squirrel. I'm like, oh, it's a cute cartoon. It must be good for the kids. And then he bought it. The guy <laughs> looked at him and was like, are you sure? Yeah, and he's like, yeah, yeah I'm sure. It, it looks like Banjo Kazooie. It looks like Banjo Kazooie. Like and then, you know, w- one day my dad came down. He's like, what the fuck are you guys <laughs> playing? <laughs> yeah, so then we had to return the my, game that My day. neighbor really? got us <laughs> yeah, my, he my took neighbor it back. was our babysitter, and he, he got us into, like, He took it back right away. Oh, man. He brought it over one day. We had an Xbox, but we, we can only play, like, teen games. Like we, we got like Bionicle here. So like, oh, fuck. Yeah. And then he brought like COD 4 over. We were playing like the Gilly and the Miss <laughs> mission. I was like, oh, I love that mission. Yeah. Ch- check this shit. And then my mom was like screaming, out, Mike, you're going to show my kids this shit. What the fuck? And then, and then of course, we bought like all those games after. We like, I let my dad play. And he's like, oh, yeah. Fucking. My dad got to like 10th prestige on COD 5. Oh, what shit. a man! Yeah, what he, a man! Oh, he shit, loved he it. Hard, he loved it, and then he can't play now because like there's D rank lobbies, so he's like scared. Yeah, gonna get D-ranked. it's just full of hackers now. It's yeah, yeah, all, all like even, even Black Ops too. Yeah, is, like Black Ops. Yeah, like, you, it's not even that far back. You you play like Modern Warfare two now. You can get fucking sick like modded lobbies where you play yeah. and it's just like fucking. You're now a zombie. Yeah, you have to fucking chase though. people around you. Like, I don't, I don't remember mm-hmm. playing this one. Yeah. <laughs> was, this, was this here when I got the game? Or what? I don't going? remember this. <laughs> like, it just... But no, it's still good. It's still fun, though. You like, you like that new... Still waiting on that remake. Call of Duty 4 or Modern Warfare, just the new one. Oh, the reveal trailer? Where everyone's like, dude, it's so graphic. Like, that's such a ploy. It looks by, so uh, good, though. By Activision, though. They, yeah. they just, like, tell all the critics to say it's like, oh, that's the worst it's ever been. Like, Well, no, what's funny that's is... That's crazy, though. No, what's funny, though, is that, like... When I saw the trailer, I was really into it because I thought it was like probably a pe- prequel or something like that. No, but it's, apparently it's a different time. It's a totally yeah. It's yeah, a totally different time. Like all like the old OGs and yeah. shit. Ooh, shit. Yeah, yeah like but Gaz it's and like uh, what's his what's that? So Res no? no Price. No. The guy with the That's ghost cool. mask. Ghost. The guy with the ghost mask. Was his name Ghost? Ghost. It wasn't ghost. Yeah, yeah, it was. With the, ghost? With, the, ghost. with the mask with the, like the white oh, splotches. Like, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah, it's ghost. That was ghost? Yeah. yeah ghost. Is it with ghost? Yeah. yeah. Modern, modern Warfare? Ghost and ghost. Un, un- fucking original name? Come on. <laughs> <laughs> but no, <laughs> like, anyways. No, the dude, guy named, yeah, yeah, and then they named, that's what I'm saying. That's like Call of Duty Ghost. They named the fucking guy Ghost. Like, fuck yeah. off. But no. No, his name was Bones. His name was Bones. <laughs> No, no, that's from it ghost. was ghost. <laughs> it was ghost. Don't listen to saying um, everything I say the greatest. But no, anyways, like it's just that fucks with my mind though because like I'm so used to the timeline that we all know and that should be canon. But like all of a sudden they're like, well, guess what? Fuck you boys. Yeah, Here's I'm, a new I'm, timeline. I'm so Same characters. It, though, like, fuck fuck oh, this yeah, old, like, fuck this old shit, man. It's like, like Halo though. Fuck this. And that's like bringing back the OG fucking zombies characters like Rick Toffin and fucking yeah. Dempsey, those Tan- boys? Uh, Dempsey and fucking Nikolai. 
the the that's true. And, um, that's true. Uh, Takio. Takio, yeah. Takio. Takio. I always like to play with the German guy. Great disgrace! Yeah. German guy was my favorite. You're, you're walking around finding yeah. the radio, so that shit was That's good, that y'all. Ah, the fun of our for DG tour, my oh, favorite. Dude, that was my favorite gun, man. Yeah, I love that. That was a fucking I, I just fucking hope they get rid of the dogs, man. Fuck the I, dogs. What, I the hellhounds? Dude, I, hate, I love no, 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 the no. hellhounds. They hell get hell. max the kill ammo streak, after, The kill streak. The kill streak. Oh, oh, the kill streak. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And Release the, the dogs! That shit is well, bullshit, like that. man. I fucking no, hate the dogs. AC 130s, chopper gunners, bring that shit back. Oh my god. Yo, fuck the dogs. That shit is fucking stupid. Somebody calls in the dogs, I throw my controller down. Down. I'm like, fuck, fuck it, this. I quit. Don't let him call in the dogs in the first place. That's your yeah, fault. Maybe it, it's like, oh, now them. I have to stand still and shoot at the dog. Fuck Matt, that shit. Matt, that's that's not not game. What game did you play as a kid? Well, you know, a little Mario Kart. Oh, yeah. Classic <laughs> yeah, Pokemon. Classic. Little... Super Smash Bros. Little Super Smash Bros. You, so you're like a Nintendo Pokemon guy, Red. Fully. Uh, I'm just too poor to have video games. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> <laughs> I had to buy them myself. Sacre so like just growing up in Lower Quebec, just yeah. sacre bleu. <laughs> like, created a bag of marbles to some kid for a fucking Game Boy one time. That's like, such a steal. That's such a steal. And, my, and, my old back, and my old deck of Yu-Gi-Oh cards. And, yeah. uh, like, it I wasn't a full game trade, it was, you had to go hard. He was really into marbles, man. I dumped, uh, <laughs> he liked I dumped that cat a, eye. a Charizard Pokemon card over to my friend. Or four of his Game Boy Advance games. Dude, that's sick. fucked, man. I wish I could that's just and it was not a good Charizard. No, no, but it wasn't like the shiny one. Uh, okay. No, it was it just was a normal Charizard. Because like, yeah. I know Charizard cards are going for like 200 bucks. Now. <laughs> yeah, no, I didn't make <laughs> yeah, that. Yeah, dude, what the fuck? Dude, my friends are buying Pokemon cards again and they're like doing unboxing videos. I'm like, what the fuck like, are you guys doing? Fo- folks, that's not like the most fun ever. Cards. Cards. It, it's, mm-hmm. it's fun, but like, I'm like, dude, you're a grown man. <laughs> like, you, those are full Pokemon. He, he opens like, he got like this rare one. It's like a new guy and he's like, this is 30 bucks on Amazon! I'm like, dude, you're rich. <laughs> yeah, you paid 8 bucks, bucks for that fucking set of Case, yeah. I never got into... I was more of a Bakugan kind of guy. <laughs> hey, we roll that shit. Yeah, bro. Yeah, yeah, so I watched the TV yeah. show, too. Uh, yeah. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah. I was more of a Bakugan. And a, and a Blade... Beyblades, Bay 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 dude, that shit. was the shit. Yeah, they got Beyblades Bay 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 Dude, Bay honestly, Bay they got they actually got banned in my school because at my elementary yeah, school. Yeah, they got banned in my school too. Yeah, because like, yeah. because we were having a fucking blast and teachers were like, this is distracting for the children. Yeah, no, yeah, fuck, fuck you, that. teachers. Like Pokemon's even worse. <laughs> <laughs> you get to it to Pokemon. Pokemon, yeah. You start Tamagotchis. Like, yo, Tamagotchis like, were the shit. Yo, that was straight banned. When I was when I was grade four, I was a fucking kindergarten monitor, and I got fucking I got kicked out. Because I kept trading Pokemon cards with the kid. Oh, did you really? <laughs> yeah. And, and I was like, oh, and I was, no. the and I was ripping them off oh. hard. <laughs> 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 then, so I'm like, yo, yeah, uh, I'm like, yo, yeah. This guy's not actually that good. I, I, I got a good one. For I get like, right, a, right, I get right, like right. a caterpie, just like, yo, What's yeah. What's your this best trade? One of the What's best cards in the fucking game. <laughs> What's amazing. What's what, your what best trade? Is like a caterpie. Yeah. <laughs> caterpie with you a fucking Charizard. I gave him a caterpie. What'd you get? He gave me a Blastoise. Oh my god. He probably went up to his mom's like, yo, mom. No, it wasn't a caterpie. It was a fucking disgrace. Get out. No, it wasn't. It wasn't a caterpie. It was the what. It's a uh, the Butterfree. Butterfree. Um, Butterfree. Dude, I remember. Oh, shit. Shit. I strange. totally remember monitors. We had to no, it was, it was <laughs> shit. I didn't want it. Grade 5, grade I, 4 I, I, monitors. Do you remember Buddies? Do you ever have Buddies? Oh, yeah, yeah. No. Were you, were you, oh, like, yeah, yeah. Grade 4s yeah, go bit. with, like, kindergartners. And yeah. Like, Yo, you're my buddy, man. Yeah. You know, try to write that. this sentence. Like, the pigs or something. I don't know. <laughs> but, like, dude, I remember, like, I always wanted to be a, not a hall monitor, but a principal monitor. Because the oh. principal monitor got the sickest job. There was like cameras outside, and you get to watch like if kids are fucking up outside. Mm. And you go, you call them on PA. Uh, Johnson, uh, you can't be doing that in Foursquare. <laughs> and you, like, you have like a little cheating screen. bitch. You can't be doing yeah, that. Yeah, fucking sick. snitch. I, did, I wanted to be a snitch so bad. to be the narc. I was I in the principal's <laughs> office, but I didn't get to do that shit. You know, I was just stuck sick there part. Part. every fucking day. Okay, yeah, so Shane, you know, you know the most embarrassing. You know how you're talking about like, embarrassing moments? Yeah. Okay, I I know one of them. I was in middle school. So like grade six, I was going to Tardy Kid. We had Tech Ed in Moody, and then we had this like Tech Ed shop, and I Moody, Moody Middle or yeah, Moody Middle. Really, you went to Moody Middle? Not the same time as you. Oh, okay, fuck right. You. Sorry, my <laughs> Oh fuck! Hey man, I got excited. You're what, older than me. What pod were you in? I was in yellow P pod. Oh, all the Asians go to you. You got the piss pod. All the retards <laughs> go to red. All the retards go to red. All the cool kids go Yo, to red, you... and the smart kids go to blue. Yo, do you remember that that story where fucking I think it was in yellow Acid pod. Puddle? Where, well, not that, but, like, they the one where, the like, the rats lived underneath yep. the yellow pond, they yep. just fucking pissed under there? Yeah. yeah and the, the, did you remember about the acid puddles? Pond. No, I didn't hear about that one. Yo, there was one time where we had this pyromaniac teacher who, like, lit shit on fire in class. He, <laughs> I think he got fired. But, um, what? 
He lit the acid puddle on fire. <laughs> he went outside. He had like a gasoline in his like. Suitcase. What are you, what are you like, talking what about? Ad, what are you talking about? Acid puddle. It's like this big dent, like a pothole in like the back. Like Moody's like pretty. It's like set up in pods, right? Yeah. So yellow pods like up on a hill. It's like very isolated from the rest of the school. Like all the it really pods is weird. That was I was weird, man. But wow, I was in, I was in red pod, kids man. On track for success, eh? Yeah, dude. Yo, literally, dude, I, all the Asians yeah. and dude. all the fucking weird kids went to. Honestly, yeah. anyways, I was in red pod. I had Mr. Keeler, the best fucking teacher. Keeler went to Tanj after. I still oh, talk that to, I fucking talk, traitor! I still talk to Keeler. He, he's, Actually, yeah, yeah. He, he's in. You go back. Anyways, yellow pod had this fucking this divot in the little pothole, hmm. and when it would rain. Kids would throw, like, juice boxes and spit and shit and, like, crayons in it. Mm. It would just be the most stinky, disgusting little pile, right? Mm. And then, like, one of the teachers, like, he's like, okay, guys, check this out. Put, like, gasoline in it, and he just lit it on fire. The fucking acid puddle was burning <coughs> for, like, ten minutes. <laughs> shit. But that's, that's all the whole story I have to say. Do you, but, um, do you fucking remember behind, at the back of Red Pod, the there was that driveway dancing. that would get you into, essentially, the parking lot yeah, area? Yeah, like, next to the basketball court and shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember there was one time there was this big truck behind there, and my friends, are li- friends and I are like, yo. Let's fuck this truck up. <laughs> so we actually took like a bunch of juice boxes, put them underneath the tires, and we waited. And then just as the truck was about to leave, a teacher saw what we were up to, and she's like, "Don't fucking move that truck!" <laughs> and like it just, and she's like, "Get that shit out of the What's truck!" What's the worst thing that's gonna happen yeah. to the fucking juice box? Yeah, like it just, <laughs> nothing's and, gonna happen to the fucking truck. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and like, and she's like, "Get those juice boxes out of there! You're all in trouble!" And I'm like, "All right." Took a juice box and I just fucking bolted. I'm like, "I ain't getting in shit!" And like it just, yeah. yeah. Dude, I, I regret being such like a goody two shoes back in the day, like. I was a bastard. What <laughs> like I wish I knew what I was a rat. I wish I knew what I was gonna do because like pissed everyone. There's no consequence. There's literally no, no consequence. They tell your parents, and you're like, ah shit. That's it. That's it. There's That's no, it. That's the career. Go, go to jail. You can fucking strip naked in middle school and fucking walk around like harassing people, mm. and you'd be like expelled for a few days. Yeah. And it's like, all right, yeah, I did that. that Yo, now no, I also remember back in Moody Mail was playing uh, Red Ass. Yeah, Red Ass. Oh, Red Ass? Yeah. God damn. Oh, yeah. So much fun. Red Ass? Dude, I suck Dude, at I that play game a game of Red Ass right now if you guys wanted to. I'm down. Do you have a hacky sack? We have that I mean, red I... ball right there. Dude, I suck at Red Ass. Yeah, I, was, I haven't I was, played I was years, pretty good. I haven't played years. I had a Red Ass pretty like half the time I played it. Dude, I remember I, I got so cheese. fucking oh. lucky though because <laughs> yeah, you do. I, w- I got so fucking lucky though because I remember there was one time where I was up on the wall and I was going to take the hit. I'm just like fucking nervous, like Is ready to like take that shot. <laughs> <laughs> Butt cheeks spread, bent over, ready I, to I take tra- it from Big Jim. Up. I'm up against the wall. <laughs> um, anyway, has something so, on my back. Um, my friend Jacob, he fucking takes the throw, gets right in between my legs, misses. I'm like, oh, it's game over. I'm able to turn around on him. He gets on the wall, chuck it so fucking hard, hits him right here at the back of the spine. Paralyzed. Paralyzed. (laughs) I fucking paralyzed. Yeah, yeah, because somebody in the nuts, though. Yeah, yeah, where you you hit it off the floor, it bounces off the wall, comes back and hits their balls. And everyone's like, ooh, he's walking the girl. Drop. He's a pussy. He's a balls now. I I once, I was peeking, like I was was bending over, I, I, I looked through my legs. Got through it and he'd be right in the forehead. Oh. <laughs> yeah. That's so rough. That was, Why the fuck would you do uh, that? Because he's curious. You yeah, do. it's just, scary when you're I was you're just up looking. There. Yeah, it is. It, it, it's nerve wracking. You, you, you hear it like whistling past you and then it's on the wall. You're like, oh thank God. <laughs> thank you, Jesus. Like, what was the most experienced kid sexually in your elementary school? <laughs> elementary? Yeah. I don't know about elementary, but I do know middle about school. Middle, probably, middle yeah. school? Probably. There's one dude, middle. Jacob. Jacob, like, fucked, like, all the herpes chicks, man. Like, <laughs> he he probably like, got herpes. Skin. He looked like he was in, like, grade 12 when he was in grade 8. Not because he failed grade... He just... He matured, man. He yeah. was six foot, like, three in grade 8. And he had, like... Like, a smoldered fucking jar. Like, I knew I knew a buddy, and he, like, introduced me. I'm like, yo, you don't go here, man. You're a teacher. <laughs> Fuck <laughs> off. <laughs> yeah, like... And then there's a few thoughts, like, here and there in grade 8. Like, the one first chick I knew, like, the best friends in one of these chicks, he's like, yeah, man, I just want my pink on D1 grade 6. What the fuck are you looking at me? She's like, yeah, like, are you saying oh. my parents are poor? <laughs> yeah, he's like, what are you saying? <laughs> no, no, there's a few very experienced kids. Not in elementary oh, yeah. school. High school. high school. Heritage high school. Woods was a yeah, fuck school school. Yeah, yeah, like, there's, there's a lot of kids. shit. Dude, Heritage is way worse now, man. There's, like, a huge, I don't know, just, like, a huge wave of, like, fucking... Horny people. Must be horny kids. Like, <laughs> dude, we had that thing where it's like, we 
Uh, I'm I'm kind of remembering it now. There was this one chick, and she she didn't move, but she had like I think she went to like some boarding school or something. Yeah. But she was very she was always like two years older than us, and the oldest kid on our block was like of course three of course years older than me. Always. She uh, right. Always. She was a little more Let's experienced. Stay yeah. Mm-hmm. So we had this like ha- like our buddy's house had an unfinished basement, but they had like a little playhouse <laughs> in the middle, and I remember like. I, I always wanted to like chill with them and they're like no Mike you're too young and I was like alright I'll just chill like play drugs or something <laughs> and then like my brother older brother's friends they, they would always chill with her like three dudes one chick in like that room you're already seeing some red I'm slowly flags. starting to realize those eight year olds and that one ten year old were not t- playing house man they were playing doctor they were playing doctor they were tickling coochies they told me like yeah man we saw tits for the first time like, and I was all piecing it like what? Oh my god, was it Zoe? <laughs> I'm like, no fucking way, man. That's some fucked yeah. up shit. Like, I was like, it all came together. I'm like, damn. I wish I, was, I wish I was eight. <laughs> I was six. <laughs> fucking bastards. God damn. Very terrible. Just, yeah. No, fuck, dude. Holy shit. Hey, man, it wasn't all fun and games. I had a, I had a game with Jamil. Jamil. He called it the penis game. <laughs> I, we I would just... run to the street and whip out our cocks. <laughs> 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 just because we knew we weren't allowed to do it. Oh my god. We played a shoe game where we, That's it? You where just we walk chill on the cul de sac. Yeah, yeah, everyone would take like, off one shoe. Yeah, you ready to this, is actually, this should be an Olympic sport. Whip out our cocks. I don't know how kids came up with this. Game, have cock. But, but no, you, everyone has one shoe and they have to hop. Right, and then one guy's like the shoe master, so everyone shows. Oh, I throws, play that. I play that. Right, yeah. it's, it's so fun, fun. It's fun. dude. Fun so fun. everyone has to hop, and basically the shoe master gets like thirty left shoes, and he gets to chuck them at the at people. So if you get hit by Yo, a shoe, you're out. What? Last person standing wins. It's That's the fuck. It's the funnest game That's ever. So cool though. No, like, yeah. No. Dude, you get to hop. Never, you never played never, that game? Never played that. Dude, I've so, never played it, played but it, right? I'd be down to play that. Like, dude, no. I don't know who came up with it, but dude, yeah, as a kid, best the best age is like. Four to seven. See you the play one, that game, dude, you're on top see of the cloud thing, nine. Yeah, see, you like, the, the one thing I remember growing up as a kid with shoes is, like, you know, you fucking take your shoes, you tie them up. Like, old crappy shoes. Take them, tie them up together, and just chuck them over a power up, line. Man, oh, those were the shit. That was, was the good. day, yeah. And you knew. Like, for me, when I was a kid, <laughs> I fucking took a pair of old shoes I had, chucked them up on the power line. I'm like, this makes me the man. I own this street. Yeah, you're the like one guy on Ioko who has those shoes been there for like seven years. Those yeah. Those have been chilling there. Yeah. Yeah, I never did that. I played Tag. I played, um... Red Rover. Red Rover, yeah. Grounders. Grounders, Grounders was yo, that lit. was the shit. Grounders was fun. Yeah. We still played this one today. game where it's like, um... I play nighttime. Grounders now. You can still play Grounders. It's called oh, yeah. Grounders. Here and it it's the same game... You just Except you gotta bring a 15 case. <laughs> and if you don't have a drink in your hand and somebody says bearders, you're it. But you play grounders. What? And you can Wait. pour as much beer on the person that's got their eyes closed as you want. Oh, oh no! Oh, oh, no. Oh, oh no! Let's play that. Let's uh, let's actually play that. Let's like, play Brown, Brown, Brown's 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 Oh, I mean, like, let's play that like as soon as we finish recording this. Okay. Yeah, <laughs> Beerders. I played it like twice. I'm a grown ass man. <laughs> there's, there's I played a, it like twice. There's, there's a playground I literally only t- one minute one minute from here. <laughs> okay. We're going. Yeah, you forget how hard fucking grounders is. You gotta walk around with your eyes closed, Dude, climbing on you're shit. If you're mangled, and people fuck with you. I've, I've played I've played grounders somewhat recently while mangled. It's very fun. I, I did too. Actually, yeah. <laughs> I played that bramble. It was fun as fuck. Yeah, bro, hundred percent. The one thing I always remember as a kid was you know when you're playing grounders, you know the person's calling out grounders and shit, and then you you're just hang there. And you want to get to like the other side of the playground? You fucking do one big jump, do like land, yeah. <laughs> like land on the air. When they're like grounders, and you're like, nah, nah like uh, you fucking liar. Your last step was on the ground. <laughs> I always but take they, they don't shoes, know that. So like, <laughs> yeah, the fucking worst. <laughs> fucking broken dishes, fucking broken dishes. That was the piece of garbage you played grounders. <laughs> uh, So what else are we gonna cover today? Hey, I have a fun oh, sorry. question. We never talked about how we're outside, but I feel like we yeah. Uh, oh, we never even we never, we never even did an intro. Yeah, it's gorgeous out today. I mean, so. intro was kind of like about Hitler. So yeah. Well, hey like, guys, welcome to episode nine of the episode podcast. Ten. Episode ten. <laughs> um, <laughs> Man died. There was a uh, there's a question I had. Mm. Can you get fucking mad at the person that got you sick? 
Yes. Mm. And this is recent because and this I'm, is I'm, my honest. I'm finally wait. recovering from this cold. I don't know. My wait, younger wait. brother always gets us sick, and I know it's him because he comes home sniffling like this. Mm. I'm like, oh. <laughs> and he just yeah. rolls around on the floor like a dog and he goes I'm sick by the way oh I know I'm like okay uh, there's a pot of chili don't fucking double dip it and I see him <laughs> taking sips I'm like ah, alright sure enough fucking he got he got my dad sick he got my brother sick he got me sick and he got my fucking girlfriend sick because we all fucking ate the chili <laughs> fuck it we don't call him, call him a dirty mud roller uh, yeah. just rolls in mud and gets like, all these diseases and shit you're fucking dirty mud roller dirty like mud roller. And, but, yes, but, and yes I can get mad at him because I know for a fact it was him but, every single time no, no, I say you gotta play in your own immune system though that's yeah. Yeah. Man. he's got because a strong ass immune my, system my, though because starting dirt starting dirt don't know what to say dirt. Yeah. I already eat dirt man. build that <laughs> build that immune system <laughs> start eating worms and shit why matter. is your little brother's immune system getting you sick are you saying you can't be mad at the person because someone else got them sick so the origin, you mad at the disease, mad at the cold. What are you, what are you suggesting here? If something's going around, everybody's got it. Yeah. You okay. You're <laughs> bound to get it. You're bound to get it from somebody. Oh, is this about the everybody's, norovirus? Everybody's, everybody's fucking got the. No, no, no. When he had the shits. Is this Sorry. about the norovirus? No, no, no. I'm talking about like colds. You know, everybody always, up, everybody always backs. says somebody got me sick. <laughs> And it's like, okay. But you know, every, for everybody's but fucking but sick. Again. Everybody's That's fucking not. sick. God damn it, Flint. <laughs> and if everybody's sick, is. and some people don't get sick. Yeah. Okay, it's the say you live system. with, you say you live with Kirsten, system. and she comes home coughing one day. And you're just like, okay. <laughs> she has a cold. Two days pass, she's fine, and then you start coughing. Are you going to blame the other person who lives in your house? Oh wait, the other person's Curtis. That who are you gonna blame? <laughs> yeah, who are you gonna fucking blame? Yeah, that's true. The the air outside? <laughs> no, you're gonna blame Curtis. Then. Should I? Yes, because if she's if if there's another person living in the house, then there's an exception. But if it's the only two people, and you know for a fact that your younger brother's an asshole, <laughs> is it inevitable Just, that people are I don't getting think this sick? Applies but it, but to it's, say it's, like, I remember, I remember everybody's getting sick, then you're gonna get it somewhere. Isn't it another, fucking so. inevitable that you might get sick? Yeah. Well, have you guys been sick? Everybody has it. I've no, been sick. Yeah. Been sick I got sick. No, like, like, like have, have I got anyone here sick? But what, recently, what, no. I've been pretty well, sick. What, what once once it happens to you, then it's over, and you fucking can't get it anymore. And you watch all these other poor fuckers getting sick, and it's yeah. fucking hilarious. I think <laughs> I, got, I, got, I got David sick once, and I know oh, for yeah. a fact I got him sick because I I got I David sick in. once too. Yeah. I don't know for a fact I got him. Yeah, sick. because he, he goes, I swear to God, if I'm sick right now, and I was like, what? I remember, but then he's like, he's like. I'm really kind of scratchy. I'm really tired. And I'm like, yeah. dude, those are all the symptoms I have. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, See? there is no way. And he comes into work tomorrow. He's like, uh. <laughs> and I'm, I'm feeling good. I'm like, what do you have now? He's like, I have a fever. I'm like, yeah, fever. Okay. Dude, like, I remember, I I remember last time I got a, a, last time I got a flu was from my youngest sister. Um, my she youngest sister. And no. fucking, she was like, had a straight flu. I'm like, oh God, please, for the love of God, don't get me sick. Two yeah, days flew? later, I got the flu, yeah, it, and then I literally flu. came up to her. I'm inevitable. like, "You're the one that should have been fucking aborted." Like, <laughs> fuck you. <laughs> like, dude, you. when you're sick though, when you have the flu though, it it's the blows. worst, man. Like, you just want to kill dude, yourself, hundred percent. I I can deal with having a sore throat. I can deal with having a stuffed up nose. Yeah. I can't deal with fucking being nauseous. Being nauseous is like one of my least favorite. I hate things. being nauseous. It's, it's like just... it's like, dude. I would rather have someone <clears throat> every week. Punch me in the balls, then be nope. nauseous for the rest nope. of my life. Well, for the ugh. oh yeah, yeah. Jeez. Would you rather? Like, would you rather have a? Would you rather be nauseous? Some guy just uh, can be Monday, can be Friday, week, yeah. But you never know when it's coming. Yeah, it just happens out of nowhere. Just like one guy just balls. goes, he's a midget comes up, <laughs> and comes running through the bushes. Nah, no, surprise, <laughs> bitch. Nails you. Ba da ba ba ba. Yeah, literally. Like just, yeah. But or like be nauseous, like dude. Being nauseous is literally one of the worst pains in the world. Especially if you're drunk. Away. Especially if you're drunk. Yeah, because it's it amplifies the spins. It spins. The spins, yeah. The you ever spins. sleep in your bed and you're like, dude. And everything's I, doing this. You like, turn, as you, you turn one like, way, your brain's like, going nah, like this. It's even worse than the way I was before, but if I turn the other way, it's going to be the same thing. Yeah, but what, what the, the good thing about being nauseous is there's, a, there's always like a position that makes you the most comfy, and you're like, <laughs> yeah, oh, you oh yeah, that's the one. You no one's, no one's yeah. weird is that like, sometimes you just got a tactical chunny, man. You just gotta, yeah, but it comes, just gotta pull it. You, you pull it, you feel like you're on cloud nine for, so you gotta for pull 30 minutes, 
and then it comes back. You See, know no, I mean? it's weird. This is going to sound weird, but like actually, one away. thing that and helps me, like for, for some reason, wow. it really, really yes. helps me, yeah. is that like Fucking again. Yeah, like for me, if I'm like really, really nauseous and I can tell it's going to come, one thing yeah. for some reason that helps me is that if I'm already like my head's already in the toilet, ready to go. Like for some reason that helps and it actually calms it down. And it makes it go away. I'm like porcelain bowl. Yeah. As long as you're riding that porcelain yeah. fucking train, you're yeah. Good. Yeah. <laughs> you step for away me, from the toilet, you feel gar. gar- yeah, for you me, feel like garbage. I always, I always just pull the trigger. No, oh, you do. Always for me. Hey, Goodbye. <laughs> but, yeah, if, I, if I'm sober, I can't pull the trigger. But if I'm drunk, dude, I'll go like up and actually deep throw myself, and I'll always get hurt. <laughs> like it just, it just. <laughs> Every time, I love the sound effect. <laughs> like it just sounds like because that's what puke sounds like. <laughs> no, like it sounds just... worse. It sounds like a guy's dying. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you know. <laughs> I, I, yeah, that was actually really good. <laughs> I realized like that people, just... you know, uh, like anorexic people, they, you know how they're like, oh yeah, like I'll eat a lot, but then I'll throw up. Mm. They don't throw up because like they want to be skinny. They throw up because they get that high after. Yeah. Like you know, like after you throw up, it feels so. Mm. You feel sometimes. Like, sometimes. Sometimes. No, all the time. No, 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 I feel like there's definitely like okay. so like first of all that's so bulimic. It's a high. Yeah, so sorry, bulimic. Bulimic. My, no, my bad, my bad. Not anyway. Like, and sorry. that's a psychological problem where they're trying to excel and they've associated food with fat with bad. But yeah. also, isn't that high that you get from why do you have goosebumps here? Sorry, anyways. Oh, <laughs> goosebumps! Bumps! Oh, oh. God, that's actually sick. <laughs> oh, wow. goose that's bumps. actually sick. Yeah. But no, you know, you know what I mean? Like that, 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 like Jamie, that's an addi- that's an addiction now. Yeah. Like yeah. that feeling, it feels good. It feels good. Coming from really shit. It, it, it only feels Yo. good though when you're fucking. Pull him up. Big team. It, it only feels. Bruno. Hey. Yo, fuck. Yo, well, where up? you at, dude? We're uh mid podcast right now. You should uh. Bruno, you coming? Swing through. Mid-podcast? Yeah. I'm about to head to the gym right now. I told well, no, you're not, Bruno. Bruno. You're yeah, coming. He's bulking. How long are you guys for? I mean, uh, Jimmy, 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 we're all planning on going in an hour. Bruno, we'll you're such you a fucking Chad. <laughs> Bruno's a Chadwick. <laughs> you're such a fucking goose. I'm uh, so sorry, boy. Bruno, are you hitting chest today or what? It's leg day. Hit it tomorrow. I'm going tomorrow. Come, tom- go come tomorrow. Hit it tomorrow, Bruno. Come, come swing through. You'll pull up. You said you'd pull up, my dude. You said you'd pull up. Yeah, you right. I am <laughs> yeah, right. You're right. Ah. You're right. Jamie, pull up. Ah. All right, Bruno. I'll see you. I'll Bruno, s- by the time you're here, the cast's going to be over. We'll be playing Smash, so it's going to be chill. Bruno, I'll see you in 10 minutes. 10 minutes? Yeah, bro. <laughs> Quick set. <laughs> Sounds good. All right. Calamity Cannon. Calamity Cannon. All right. Peace. All right. Um, Love you. Link. But anyways, so what were we talking about? Um, uh, anyways, fucking, uh, what were we talking about? I don't know. Um, Old Milwaukee, throwing up. Throwing up. Uh, <laughs> the, the high after Oh, that up. reminds me. Fucking the throwing up thing. Um, I was on, on SkyTrain towards the night market. And fucking, uh, I was on SkyTrain on my way there to Richmond. And all of a sudden, there's this guy on there who does not look fucking good. And he actually goes, like, the doors are closed and everything, the train's moving. He literally goes, like, in the corner where the door is and, like, the the glass wall thing. He just goes there and he's, <laughs> and just starts puking. I'm like, bro, on the fucking sky train, Dude, man? Really? In Montreal, like, I, saw, I saw puke at least seven times on like, the sky train. Why? Oh, they, uh, like, why? Like, why? Like, the like, metro, yeah. Do they, they go hand over hand? Like, no, dude, like, there, there was, like, a whole <sighs> battle scene. Someone tried to clean it up with, like, Tim Hortons wrappers, <laughs> but they just left it there. So it was, like, a whole, like... Oh, that's so gross, man. ...betrayal of just this mountain of oh. puke, and you can smell it. So, like, everyone was uh, evacuating the area. It was, like, 1 o'clock. I was like, oh, fuck. We're, we're not gonna lie, boys. I've puked on a bus before. Ah! ah dirty son of a bitch. Yeah, sick fuck. One time I was so fucked after one of the brown staff parties. And I didn't even hop on the sky train. I took a bus. It took me into the fucking middle of nowhere. And I just Good remember job. being Good like kill. Kill. puking on a newspaper, closing it, <laughs> taking the next stop, and then just being in the fucking snow at like 2 a.m. Being like, ah, oh, fuck, with I gotta get home. Triple kill. <laughs> I'm so fucked. <laughs> But, yeah. I, w- I never I never threw up on a bus, but I'm I was right beside up. Brayden when he threw up on a bus. Uh, <laughs> oh, <laughs> party bus? Nah, nah. This is 2014, man. He fucking threw up on a fucking bus from we were we were at the fucking Res in Pit in Pit Meadows. Hmm. Jesus Christ! Fucking skid shit. I, I, I almost threw up on the bus because Halloween party. Yeah. 
I almost threw up on the bus, but fun. this was like after. I, I don't. I don't remember. Yeah. I just saw pictures of me caressing Brayden while he was puking. Mm. I, I don't remember um, it at all. <laughs> fucking! I almost threw up on the bus, but this was like a bus leaving from Venice to Vienna, in Austria, because like I fucking partied hard at this masquerade party. I didn't know. I got fucking lost Mask. in Venice. I didn't know where the Mask. fuck I was. I didn't get home till like three o'clock in the morning after wandering the streets for like four hours. My fucking roommate come or uh, wakes up because I I just boom pop pop on the open the door. And he's just like, dude, where have you been? I'm just like, I've been places. And then the next and then I got home at three, and then we had to be on the bus by six a.m. to go to Vienna. Oh. So I'm just there at the very back of the bus in the center seat, the very end of the bus. And I'm just like this and just like holding a fucking like a fucking Tesco bag, like plastic bags is like holding it just ready to fucking puke. And like my fucking four neighbors are sitting all up beside me. They're just like this, like trying to make ready sure. For your yeah, Don't just ready you. for it. And I thankfully oh, didn't. But like there was one part where yeah, I'm like, yeah. like the baby puke came. I'm like. Yeah. Fuck, it's coming, boys. Everyone brace yeah. for impact. But, no, like, you just you want to fucking bet? Oh, uh, no, I didn't send it. I, I held it back. I, I fucking swallowed it. I'm like, oh, oh. I was there. <laughs> I've only ever done that once. I'm sorry. I've had baby puke where, where, like, it comes up and then you, you have to, like, oh, okay. Yeah, that's you, that's you have to that's that's so that's I was so wasted that I didn't even face me. Really? I was so wasted. at staff party. Cab home. We're coming up right up the street here. Right up Parkway Boulevard. I feel it come up. I swung it back down. I'm like, yo, you just dropped me off right here. <laughs> well, I don't know. I'm with Maddie. Maddie's in the front seat. I'm in the back seat. I open the cab door. It's just fucking. See, I remember. Dude, Brutal, Brutal recently puked in my car. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm what a bastard. Really? Brutal is no, like. No, man. We're going to be drinking. Brutal is maybe three beers deep. We're going to be actually drinking some Mickey's that we bought. For him, yeah. Yeah, and then Bruno, Bruno, like, he pulls to the side and he goes, might be a risk. Mike, just to conquer. Mike, it. I don't, I don't really like how you're driving right now. I'm like, Bruno, we're going 40, and he's like, pull over, pull over on the side of the street in like the middle of an intersection. Cars are like swerving out of the way, and he walks, and he's Bruno's just walking like this, and he starts puking while he's walking. <laughs> 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 he's like, he's like, <laughs> and he turns around, he's like, Mike, I look good. <laughs> he's puke all over his nose. <laughs> he's like, I'm like, Bruno, don't, don't smell, don't, don't breathe in. And he's like, he's like, Mike. Do I look good? I'm like, get a leaf. Get a fucking leaf. <laughs> he smears it all over himself. <laughs> that's so where, that's when the snot rocket comes in handy. Yeah, that, I was going to say, I'm like, dude, do it, do a snot rocket. He's like, all right, all right Mike. What? <laughs> 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 I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, I'm I ate an apple in the morning because I was super hungover. We were driving a fucking Cora. And I'm just like, I, love I would pull up in the parking lot. I was like, that apple ain't sitting good. I'm like, open the door as he's swinging a turn. Puke the fucking, puke the turn. All apples come out. Like, Drive by puke. That's so fun. <laughs> <laughs> like, like, at Cora. Yeah. It's like, it's, it's like a nice trail <laughs> leading to Cora's. It's just it's like, oh, this is where they're falling. I just take in the turn. I just I like, open you, the door and fucking. Girl. I bet you, <laughs> <laughs> fucking bystander just saw that. I was like, what the fuck? Like, oh, I how are you doing? Did you go in? What the fuck? Yeah, I had a nice breakfast. <laughs> <laughs> He did on the way back to you. <laughs> it was like the night before arriving. I was like feeling shitty the whole way. And in the parking lot, I had to do drive by puke. Oh, fuck my chest. They, they serve apples at Toros too. Yeah, they get some apple slices. Yeah, they get some apple slices. Look at them. Those apple slices were a bad idea. Man. Yo, I'm not going to look at apples this thing right now. <laughs> First time, that's gonna be Dude, fuck apples, I'm a, I'm a banana guy. <laughs> Granny Smith, though? Shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> Don't talk shit about you Granny Smith. Like, you like, uh, what's the other one? I like Granny. Sour, sour, delicious. Delicious. green, green. You like bananas? <laughs> You're the apple of my eye. You're very beautiful. Someone put me in their ass. <laughs> Right there. Someone put me in their ass. <laughs> Jesus. It's a little unhappy. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's true. A lot of fucking girls learn to jerk off bananas. No, it's cucumbers. cucumbers. What do you mean bananas? What bananas do you call bananas? Are bananas are actually the type of potatoes. No, you don't. You don't take it out of the fucking peel. Cucumbers now. No, no, but still, oh, they like they eat through bananas, but they they do cucumbers. Grapefruit? No, I'm saying grapefruit technique. Hot times you with grapefruit technique. Eggplant for the vegans out there. It feels like you were sucking your man's dick and fucking him at the same time. 
<laughs> imagine the guy who had to film that. Dude, imagine the guy getting his fucking dick sucked on. Imagine a his food. his husband, her husband. Dude, I'm fucking down. Oh, I want dude. a grapefruit on my car. Yeah, I do it too, man. I'm just fucking sipping a pina colada, getting a grapefruit job. You're like, this feels great. I'll say that's been happening. Fuck fruit. I'll say it again. This feels. You know, I'll say it. <laughs> <laughs> so like fuck, fuck me, right? Uh, fuck me, right? Fuck, fuck, fuck me, right? <laughs> fuck me right in the ass. <laughs> See Annabelle, whatever that one, or. Annabelle. The movie is coming out. Oh, the fucked up one? Nah. I ain't gonna do that. You, you don't like scary movies? I don't mind them, but... I don't know, there's some I just don't fuck with. The, the Nun? The, the Nun was terrible. I, yeah. No, some of the, some the horror movies are just such... The, it's the same format every time. I, I saw The Nun. I actually fell asleep. Yeah, it was so bad. Yeah. You know that, that new movie? You know Will Ferrell and the guy from Tim and Eric? Dr. Drool? Yeah, the, the two guys from Step Brothers. They made Sherlock Holmes and Watson. Oh yeah, Will Ferrell and uh, fucking something. John C. Riley. Riley. John yeah. C. Riley. Apparently that movie was shit. Yeah, yeah. no, it apparently fucking bombed. Was terrible. Bombed. And, and everyone says it's so boring. And I, I saw like a few minutes of it, and it looked looked really bad. Well, which is which is terrible because like Step Brothers was so fucking funny. I oh, feel like sorry, they should have just done a Step Brothers too. <laughs> like that would well, be the no. next success, if, right? Then it probably <laughs> exists for people who are interested in that. No, but I feel like the reason the reason it was so bad is because of the timeline. Like Sherlock is just you can't. I, I don't know if you you can make it I funny. I preferred Will Ferrell and uh, Blades of Glory and Anchorman. Blades and Anchorman, Anchorman was, was good, yeah. fucking prize Blades possession. Of Glory was, was Blades of Glory. Do you, do you guys fuck Michael Michael? Do you guys fuck with Steve Carell? He is no? finger skin. He's okay. I like he's right. Yeah. Steve Carell. He's, he's Jim Carrey. He's good in the oh, office. Boom. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> Jim Carrey, he was funny though. I fuck with Jim Carrey though, because have you seen have Spider-Man. you seen Jim Carrey's like more serious stuff? Twenty three. No, uh, Eter- Eternal Sunshine of the Spotless Mind. I haven't Mind. seen that. Seen that one? Twenty three. I'm twenty. I'm, it's like I'm seven not syllables. Funny. Eternal Sunshine of the Spotless. No, it's a good one. He he plays this. It's like a very serious role for him, and usually, <laughs> usually he's not doing those serious roles, but he's like, he really nails it. Yeah. Dude, Jim Carrey is just thing. ruining my childhood with the way he acts as an adult. Mm. Yeah, as an old timer now. Yeah, yeah. Well, he, he, he's fucking. As an old timer, he's, he's in a Sonic movie as Mr. Eggman. Eggman. Yeah, as Eggman. Sonic? Doctor Sonic. Robotnik, mind Eggman. Eggman. Everyone's fuck my fucking wife. <laughs> well, it's so funny. Like, how the fuck are they gonna cast Jim Carrey? Well, it's like, funny though because wife? Eggman, like I think, per- I think, think personality-wise, I think yeah, Jim yeah. Carrey does like a really what good idea with like Eggman. It's just he doesn't have the body. That's Danny DeVito would have been fucking Like, when perfect. I think of Eggman, I think of someone that looks like yeah, a fucking Danny egg. Danny not like this, not this fucking, fucking skinny guy. <laughs> <laughs> like, uh, you know, revived but, like, him with Sonic. Yeah. Danny did you hear they apparently did? Danny DeVito the penguin. Yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. Nice. No, yeah. yeah, well, I mean. It's a and another guy. The one and if you only. go back far enough to the Ice Ages. Apparently, I saw a trailer, though, that they actually did the proper Sonic design. Like, the the one that Reddit fixed. Oh, they Yeah. Was there ever a good Sonic game? Yeah. Yeah. Which so, one? The Sonic Mania. The OG Sonic Heroes. Original Sonic, Sonic Mania. Yeah. Not 06. Like, <laughs> yeah. Not 06. Did you see 06. the games that came out when I was a kid? Because, like, they... Sonic Heroes Sonic came out when you were so bad, kid. dude. Sonic Heroes Sonic, came out when you were kid. That the, shit was There was dope. some type around, like, Sonic, like, where he's, like, a fucking big... Also, Shadow Man, where you get to play as fucking Shadow, like and he just fucking, there's he just gets a fucking M16, and it's like, press X to gun down the enemy. Trying to get that Call of Duty hype. Yeah. Okay, a, the, the fucking little Sonic games you got at McDonald's were fucking sick. Oh, there, dude, there was one Sonic Sonic That's a whole podcast in Sonic itself. Racing. Dude, The Incredibles fucking toys from from back in the day. I still have, like, every single one of those. There was one Sonic game that I actually <laughs> remember the, the playing. That was good as fuck. Were the fucking, the, 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 the fucking mini hockey sticks in the fucking container. Oh, I think I those were those. fucking amazing. I had those ones, and I had those. There was, like, a Yu-Gi-Oh one. A video game. They had a lot of them. The, the ones these days are shit. I worked at Don's. The ones the, they have these days are just Trash. so bad. They had Yo, little, like, remember, two buttons um, fucking, like, remember, move um, up yeah. the screen to dude, press a button. Dude, and light, you see that lightning? Yeah. press another one. What? Yeah. Fuck. Lightning. Man. Wait. Wait till you hear it. Lightning! <laughs> Four. Thunder! Five. Thunder! Six. Six kilometers away. <laughs> Duck your heads down, <laughs> boy. Yeah, that's how we're here, yeah. Did you see that fucking flash though? I was like, I didn't see that. Yeah. Dude, that's a fucking badass storm. It's going. We live in fucking Vancouver, dude. 
Yeah, but I mean, I haven't, <laughs> gone, I haven't gone to good lightning strike in ages. You know, we never get thunder in Vancouver. We always we get, get steady thunder. rain. We never we get, get hard we rain. The, the name of our fucking Langley it's lacrosse rain. team is the fucking Langley Thunder. So Langley I, I don't know. I don't know about that. We were the Port Moody it, Lions. It's nothing. Okay, like, it, it never happens Panthers. here. Sorry, it's I never played here. Port Moody Panthers. Yo, don't The Port Moody team. It's like once a summer, you might get a storm here. But, like... Dude, we had, we had I think the last one, you got a Chilliwack. We had one really the good heavy one rain one where it flooded shit and everything. Yeah, yeah. Dude, I when I was a kid, oh, that was, that was, the that best that game ever crazy. when the sick. when the streets are flooded with water is to build little wooden boats with a, and fucking let I got a kayak ride. We can all use. It's a one seater though, so we'll you have guys to ever take do turns. That? <laughs> Yo, You'll better idea. The take the kayak, no. take the attach it to a fucking car, <laughs> and just fucking go down the road. There you go, yeah. man. Dude, the car's sinking, but you're on the kayak. It's like you're pretending to float in like two inch deep water. Yeah. You're like, eh, that's right. That's fun as fuck. I, I want to do that thing where people take the fucking, um, I don't know, what, like, a, like a snowboard or something like that. Like they oh, during, put like, a the rope skis. in the back yeah. of the hitch or something like that, and they put on a snowboard oh. and they're just fucking going down the road. It's no, have, you, have you seen the one that in um, fucks the shit Times Square? Have you seen the one in Times Square? Yeah. Where it went, when it, they got that blizzard last year, and then like those dudes were like just snowboarding off trucks and shit, like police are like following them. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah that that's kind of sick. I, that, that'd be a bucket list kind of thing to do. Mm-hmm. Bucket list, another great topic. I want to fucking skydive. I want to do that. Pretty bad. I want to be in squirrel suit. Uh, fuck skydive. I want to be in squirrel suit. Yeah, pussy. I want to do skydive. Yeah. <laughs> Why, Why the fuck not? would you want uh, to? Yeah. Why would you? I want to be in those. That's um, sick, man. What's what's like what's a guy's only dream? Yeah, I'm fucking to fucking fly. <sighs> Shooting a tank. Maybe that's just me. Yeah, is it is it just Come me? Th- on. Yeah, baby. Is it just me that I want to fire a tank? Like just oh, shoot yeah. off no, around yeah, the yeah, tank? Oh, Boom! That's like, more on the list. The, the, the yeah. interview, fucking Kim Jong Un. Hey. I want to get lost in the fucking Amazon forest. No, no dude, that's a that's a fear of mine. Fucking gypsy cunt. That's a fucking fear of mine. Fuck me. Mmm. Mmm. Yeah. And by lost, I mean the oh, series. Shit. Okay. I'm lost. Good. By orientation, but live. I'm going that today. You know what I mean? Travel, I that. <laughs> travel the Amazon, off the grid. Mm. Off the grid. <laughs> what are your thoughts on off the grid? No one fully goes off the grid. Mm, mm. That's not. Uh, yeah, that's not entirely the true. There was this one story in Australia. How do you come back? The world's fucking. How do you come? Did you guys hear this um, one story well, in Australia? This was recent. It was like a few years back, but like this one family, for no fucking reason, just packed up all their shit. Left all their phones, computers, and everything. Just fucking went in a car, drove, fucked off all the way from like somewhere in Australia, and just went all the way fucking. Oh, Major sorry, New but Zealand. Went somewhere in nowhere, like in Australia, and it took them like a week to be found or something like that. And they all separated, and went the their grid. own ways. Oh, really? They, yeah. How old were they? How old like, were the kids? Like in their twenties. Okay, I thought these kids were like seven. No, they no, they literally got. They all fucked off on their own way. Yeah. <laughs> No, it's fucked. Like <laughs> one of them was in Walmart. Um, if you actually go I to uh, Buzzfeed Unsolved, like, if you go to Buzzfeed Unsolved channel and look up that video, it's fucked. Like you actually watch the whole thing and you're like, "What the fuck was wrong with this family?" And they don't know why they did it. That's the weird thing. They don't know why they did it. They Probably just the did it. Probably the dad. No, dad doesn't even no, remember why he did it. He's just like, "No, yeah, exactly." Just I just remember the fucking uh, mm-hmm. the That's family break. story in uh, Survivor Man where there's like a he's like these woods. They're in Colorado, and people think you can just go hiking here, but it doesn't take a lot to get lost. The Johnson family was lost a <laughs> oh. hundred meters from the parking lot, <laughs> <laughs> and, and then you get the full account from the family, and the son's like, "We were lost for like a week. I thought about going to scout, but I didn't want to lose my family, so we stayed in one place and ate mushrooms." <laughs> <laughs> Until we finally were found. Jesus fuck. And they were like a hundred meters from, from the, the fucking parking lot. That's like that family guy fucking episode. Fucking idiots. <laughs> where they, they were just in Canada. <laughs> they were like, I'm scared for our lives. You know, starting to eat each other. Still haven't found a way back. Hey, we found them. What? <laughs> dude, dude, what? <laughs> what? They didn't think to like fucking like put their car I just ate my on. kid. He's <laughs> like, whoo, whoo. You hear that? Are we next to the fucking parking lot? <laughs> <laughs> they couldn't hear the fucking cars coming in. <laughs> <laughs> that was a weird thing. They couldn't hear cars coming in, you know, children, like, you know, laughing, having a good time and everything. Yeah, no, they didn't hear shit. After that, you're just like, I have no faith in my parents <laughs> whatsoever. Yeah. Dude, my there's parents some, are There's retarded. some really sad stories about, like, people getting lost. Like, there's this one, like, motorcycling guy, like, the two motorcyclers went on, like, 
the Trail of the Dragon, which is like this very notorious thing. Like, it's just a nice back route. And they were ripping it. And then they both got like launched off the cliff. And like one of them, one of them fell a little bit further down. And the buddy could see him, but he was like fucked under his bike. Mm. And they were there for like, oh, like two days or something. Mm. And then like the the other guy died like just next to him. And then they finally found the first guy. Yeah, you know, what happened to your friend? He's like, oh man, he's like just there. He's like dead. So like, there's some scary shit, man. And, and there was one in Balcara recently, where some dude fell off like a cliff. Recently, just hiking, mm. and then there's there's like so oh yeah, many. I, 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 I know that that's, that's, yeah, that's at, cool. Like, that's cool. Yeah. Yeah. Cool, cool Marsh. Like I know that guy. I went to middle school with him. Yeah, yeah. they they, they yeah, released yeah, that he yeah, was from the tr- yeah, like yeah, the yeah, tri-state area. With him. Yeah. Yeah. That's fucked. Yeah. It's fucked, right? Like he got he got lost and then he fucking fell off a cliff and shit. Yeah, well, it was like I remember two summers ago. Fucking who was it? It was me, me, Nicole, her friend, and Matt, and we all went up to um, Bunsen Lake. And fucking, um, as we were leaving, all of a sudden we started seeing fucking lifeguards and fucking all of a sudden paramedics and police cars started showing up and we're like, what the fuck's going on? And it was that guy who stepped off the ledge in the water and he fucking drowned. Yeah. Just dragged him down. And a drowned. lot of the, a lot of those are suicides though. There's mm-hmm. like a lot of suicides in yeah. But in his case, it wasn't a suicide. It was just like, he, he, he just, just didn't fucked. realize how yeah. deep it was. He stepped off the ledge and just went straight under. Didn't come back up. There was that one story about that one guy who watched, uh, Bear Grylls. And Bear Girls is all bullshit, but like That's he all watched right. he watched Bear Girls and he used everything he knew from it because he was like a hardcore fan. Got lost at like Cyprus or some shit and he survived because he he made, managed to get like a smoke trail. Mm. Plane found him. See, it would it would have made more nice. sense if he like P, P, drank his own pee too. So yeah. <laughs> I think honestly he he would have done yeah. a lot better though. Like this is my opinion. I think it's more genuine to watch like man. Um, Man vs. Food. Man vs. Food. Um, sorry, not Man vs. Food, but God. yeah, like Survivor Man. Like, um, Yo, is that a burger? <laughs> <laughs> Here's how you cook a, a burger fucking burger. Fucking wild. Add some fucking piss to it, add food, some flavor. Food one, though. Food one. I'm but, fucking stopped. No, honestly, though, like Survivor Man, though, like. But Survivor Man. Survivor Man is. I don't know, Les Stroud? No. Yeah. Oh he, my! He, you guys are all older than me. He's he looks joke. like Jeremy. You never seen Survivor he, Man? No. He's actually better than Man vs. Yeah. Wild because he Plus, actually he was looks like alone. Jeremy. Yeah, like, but he, he basically Jeremy, he does the same thing as Bear Grylls just before him. Yeah, and he goes solo. And he's actually oh, by strong. himself. He only has like a tiny camcorder, oh, and like really? that's it. That's all he's got. You know the Bear by himself. Bear Grylls, like a lot of it was debunked. There's one where he's like, "Oh man, I can't fucking climb over this fucking big bridge." So he like puts down a bunch of logs and shit, and then some guy he's like British, Reddit, not Australian. Oh, he's British. Some guy can't put this fan on fucking back. <laughs> and then there's a guy on Reddit who's like doing the same shit, and he turns around, he turns his camera, and there's like a highway. <laughs> 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 fucking the fucking totally guy. Debunked. Yeah. The motherfucker made him drink his own piss though. Like the director's like, okay, bear, you've been doing this for a while now. <laughs> Mr. Our Bruce. audience ship is fucking dying, dwindling. Mm-hmm. You need to do something fucking weird. He's like, dude, I heard you can drink. Oh your man, bear. Bear's <laughs> wild is still so fun to watch, man. Yeah, it's fun Except to watch. Except the episode where he's like urban exploring, and it's just the dumbest shit you've ever Wait, seen. Like a he's like, yeah, no, he just goes into an abandoned city. It's in like fucking Russia or something. And there's it's just like, yeah, dude, he's like run around some fucking probably my house. deserted, some crumbling buildings, and he's like. I'm gonna have to go up here. So he gets dropped off on a boat, and he climbs this fucking, like, thing, and gets to the roof of a building, like a skyscraper, and you're like... That sounds like he's kind of sick, though. But he's doing backflips on the roof. He's <laughs> <laughs> like, this is not a part <laughs> of survival there. <laughs> but see, like, that's the thing. Like, but see, the... go! Yeah. And he goes down, and he's like, now I'm locked in the building. It's like, why'd you go up the building? <laughs> yeah. And then he, like, makes a fucking makes a house-made deal, yeah. bomb. Oh. To blow up a door. To yeah, that's through. smart. And it's like nobody knows how to fucking make see, these bombs. That, that, that's so the funny thing because like <laughs> with um because with uh <laughs> fucking um because with Survivor Man he would actually like put himself in the middle of the Amazon like in the Just middle of fuck, fuck nowhere and like he would like survive right there and like he would have to find the village by himself. And like everything like that. I think he got bit one time and he got to the village and they fucking helped him out and everything. Bear Girls got bit, but he got stung by a bee. Yeah. <laughs> He's a fucking bitch. Dude, that's anyway. nothing against that's nothing Hot against dude. uh Bear uh, not Coyote. Coyote Peterson. Fucking Coyote Peterson on YouTube. Wait, is that the dude who yeah, stings he himself? Stings yeah, himself yeah, yeah, yeah. Animal like, Oh, gets bit with the fucking, um, the, the, the bullet hand. The yeah. bullet yeah. hand and the fucking, um, and the, the, that, that, that? tarantula the, wasp. Yeah. Dude, that tarantula was, hawk, yeah. The tarantula hawk or something. Dude, yeah, that's, that's, that's hot. No, it hawk. was the, like, that fucking, that wasp. That fucking, that, oh, the bee, dude, the I saw that. The bee killer? The, the, I mean, the cow killer. 
Yeah, so some, some dude, shit. the calculator. But the, the bullet ant is the worst one. But then he did one. No, he did the wasp one. Yeah, that. there was the, that one the was, final that one. Was one. Way worse. And yeah. he's like, it's worse than the bullet ant. It's worse. <laughs> it's, it's, so worse. worse. it's so much yeah, worse. It's like, dude, so much so worse. But dude, I he's got the fucking balls. This guy yeah, has dude, to do that shit. Yeah. I wouldn't be dude, able to be like, free, yo, I'll let this thing he fucking free has, sting like, me. Black widows and shit. He's like, yeah, man, they're actually really delicate creatures. And like his fangs are like about to stab him. He's like, ah, don't do that, buddy. Don't do that. You're okay. You're okay. He has a python around his neck too. He's like. You're kind of you're restricting my breathing. <laughs> but, uh, no, he's fucked. he's got like heavy set of testes. Like, man, though, it's such a cool guy. Literally, it, the you, fucking testicles. If you weren't scared of insects man. too, I'd do that. You make a lot of money off YouTube fucking doing that shit. You guys getting devoured? I am. Yeah, a I'm, little bit. Dude, I'm well, we can we can call yeah, it a quit soon. We're at two thousand. Okay. Two thousand beats. Two thousand beats. Dude, I'm getting absolutely nothing. Wait, what do you say? Later, tuts. It's been a blast. It's 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 been a blast. Farewell, taller, aware, loyal viewers. I think it's our one good. viewer, John from Ken, from Kansas, Kansas. <laughs> from I North really Carolina. I really views on uh, abortion <laughs> <laughs> from episode seven. <laughs> All right, all right. Anyways, later, bitches. Later, bitch.